What's up, YouTube Bots community? It's boy, Mr. Universal Sports. You know, I got to figure I'll show my handsome face once in a while. About to cover that Terrence Crawford versus Deary Jun fight. It was a very good fight, and but uh, I got to give Deary Jun credit. He has more courage than Bolton brains so far, but any other time, the corner would have stopped the fight, and I thought Tony Weeks did a good job of stopping the fight. But here's what I think of thought about Terrence Crawford. He, he, and in every round, he nearly hurt him. I mean, first, I had Deary John winning the first round up until the the knockdown, the late in the first round when Terrence Crawford switched to southpaw, and that's very and that's a very good skill <laughs> compared to like a Marvin Hagler. We used to see him switch from southpaw to conventional all the time to confuse his opponents and. That and that was impressive about Terrence Crawford. Obviously, this isn't the first time I watched Terrence Crawford. I, I stated I stated this on YouTube. I stated this in the comment section. I stated this on Facebook to my at work to my buddies. That he Terrence Crawford is a future pound for pound guy, and he looked like it today. He, that's how you beat a contender. That's how you beat a contender. You dominate them. You don't mess around. Try to like just get the easy twelve round decision. Try not to get hurt. You go out there, get the stoppage, and that's what Terrence Crawford did. That's why I was impressed. Also, <laughs> they talked about his opponents. And obviously, we heard that Manny Pacquiao is going to retire April 9th. According to Bob Bermond, he's going to retire April 9th. April 9th will be his last fight when he heals from his shoulder injury. We all know which is a lie. But here's who other fighters I want to see Terrence Crawford fight. Obviously, he's the WBO champion at 140 pounds, Junior Walterweight. But... <laughs> He won't get in there with the Heyman guys because of stupid boxing politics. I'm not going to talk about that crap tonight. We're going to, uh, so we won't see him unless he signs with Al Heyman go up against an Adrian Broner, which I think is a money fight, and Lamont Peterson, which I think is a money fight as well. Matter of fact, that, matter of fact, that will be a good fight, Peterson versus Broner, but I digress. I want to see Terrence Crawford next against Victor Postum, Amir Amin, but that can wait down the road. Manny Pacquiao and maybe even Timothy Bradley, because I heard those, I heard for Manny Pacquiao's last opponents on the list on the short list is Terence Crawford, Amir Khan, and Timothy Bradley. And obviously, with that star making performance, well, he had been a star, but obviously with that very very impressive win, auditioning for the Pacquiao fight, he he may have punched his tickets for April 9th. Obviously, we got to wait for Bob Aaron and Manny Pacquiao to make their decision. Really, Bob Aaron controls it. But that's the fight I want to see next. Manny Pacquiao versus Terrence Crawford or any one of those four guys. Not mentioning the Al Heyman guys. About Deary John, he should just he just didn't belong in there with Terrence Crawford. I know a lot of people didn't like the fight because he wasn't in the top 10, the Ring Magazine top 10 or in the ranking top 10. I don't know if he was in the WBO or mandatory top 10 or not. But a lot of people didn't want to see this fight. But I may has an appetizer want to see Victor Postum versus Terrence Crawford. That fight can be made. Then maybe push the Manny Pac. Then maybe that's it. Everything depends if Pacquiao goes to one forty or one forty seven. To make the fight at one forty, then have then have Terrence Crawford if Pacquiao, if Terrence Crawford gets past Manny Pacquiao, he obviously he'd be the, if he does that he'd be the new face of top rank. Then he'll fight Posto Nets. We don't know if he's going to be a pay-per-view star or not, but hell, I'll pay to see him fight. What do you guys thought about the fight? Anyway, it's your boy, Mr. Universal Sports, and I'm out. Peace. Have a good night. I got to go to work.